Well, hello, everybody. So, <laughs> I went ahead and put in um, the description box of the last video a link to the crochet hooks off Amazon. They went up $10. It's $23 and something now, but it's still a great deal because you get like 20 hooks. Um, plus stitch markers, the scissors, the case. Um, it doesn't matter if you um, buy it or not. It, I'm not affiliated. I, I don't have affiliated links. So if you buy, you buy. If you don't, you don't. It makes no difference to me. But people like to know. And... Um, that is what I'm using and I love them I still have my um, other set um, that I've had for a while my um, boy set that there's the cats That is a really, really pretty blue. I like that blue. Very pretty blue. Uh, I was answering... <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I was answering um, messages in the comments of my video and I did mean to do that on purpose have it post late so but anyhow getting back to the video I'm sorry <laughs> anyhow two three and four I um Oh, where was I at? <laughs> okay, so anyway. Um, I, okay, yeah. I was answering um, questions. And someone had asked, well, can you post, post the link? And, you know, not even thinking. Nah, why would I think? It's like, sure. I'll post it in the next video in the description box. Didn't think nothing of it. As soon as I hit send, it dawned on me. Russ, <laughs> why don't you just grab the link from Amazon and bring it over and do an edit on that particular video? <laughs> So that's what I did. So then I, oh my goodness. So that's what I did. And then I had to go back to the comments and it's like, okay, the link is posted. It should be there. I tell you, my mind, my heart's in the right place. But Oh, mercy me. Man, what are them cats doing? They are just going to town over there. <laughs> They're over there playing. But I wanted to get this video done for tonight. Then I got to do another video for tomorrow night. And, um... Uh, because I have to get it done now. I have to get um, the video for um, Friday midnight um, done and posted. Because me and Kevin's going out with his mom and dad uh, for dinner. What do you want? What? What? Oh. I tell you.
I, I love them kids to death. But they will be over there. Non-stop. Non-stop. It's like, come on. Get over here. Well, come on. <laughs> Don't ask me. I'm, I'm just the, um, the crocheter. And the knitter. Oh my goodness. Did anybody get in on the sale at Michael's? I did not. Um, Russ was good. Russ did not buy any. But I was good. I did not buy any though. I promise I didn't buy any. So if they're out, don't buy if they're out, don't blame Russ. Russ did not buy any. I promise. I did not buy any sale yarn from Michaels. Or from anywhere. I, I've not. The last yarn I um, purchased was Aberdeen Wool. Um, I ordered 200 more um, minis. Uh, when they had their um, pa St. Patrick's Day sale. I should have ordered 400. Ah. 500. <laughs> but I didn't. I promise. I only bought 200. Um, the Aberdeen's uh, company is going to skin me alive if I don't slow down. Because it's, you know, it's Russ. Russ plays by his own rules. <laughs> um, so, you know, you would you would think, okay, um, I bought a hundred and, I bought the pickle jar and then three more refills, right? Got those. And then it's like, okay, I know I'm going to need more minis. So I bought 200 more. But then I also had to place my yarn order for the countdown boxes. So I had to reorder a thousand more. And so then on top, then on top of that, which I already got the 200. That I bought when I was buying, yeah, the Countdown Box Yarn. I got that. But then it's like, okay, well, there's something I want to do for my knitters, you know? So, I bought 200 <laughs> Hmm. And I don't, yeah. It's like, you know, I should have just bought another thousand and been done with it. But that's what I do. Um, some some place will have a real really good sale, and I'll try and be good. I'll try. I I, I swear I I try to be good. And so I order so much. Okay. Well, either later on in the day or that night, 
Or the very next day, Russ goes back and says, like, okay, what do you got left? And it's just like, okay, why don't, why don't you just... Why don't you just place your order all at one time? And then there was that one time that I bought so much, they they put it in... They, they put it in two shipments. I bought it all at once. But it's like, um, your order's coming in two, two different shipments. Okay. Oh my goodness. I'm crazy. I just I love yarn. I love everything about it. And there's there's some yarn that I don't care for. And but it doesn't mean to throw it away. There's always someone or somebody, you know, that that would, you know, that would cherish it and use it. Even even if you gave it to Goodwill or um, a thrift shop, so they could make a couple couple bucks off it or a buck, whatever, you know. Let them have it if you're not going to use it. And I will be doing um, some more yarn tote videos this weekend. Um, me and Kevin will put um, these totes back up in the attic. And we'll bring down some more totes. And I'll make some more videos. I still got to find that one video I recorded and I forgot to upload it. <laughs> and it's like... I can't get rid of none of the videos because typically, you know, when once they're uploaded to YouTube, you can get you can get them all, rid of you can get rid of them. You don't need to save them because they're on YouTube. But um, I can't get rid of them until I find out what one I didn't upload. But anyhow, I say anyhow and the cats start crying. I don't know where Junior and Precious are. Well, they had a midnight snack. That darn um, yarn elf gave him a um, can of calf food so they're, so they're probably off somewhere sleeping they're in their food coma hmm. I took a little nap tonight in my chair I didn't sleep long. It was probably 20 minutes of that. I need to um, get my ottoman set up. So I can... Um, that way you guys can see, you guys can see better. So, let's see, this blanket. I can't raise my arms up. So, 
It's on the floor by my toes. And it comes up to my chest. That's how long it is. But we still got a ways to go. I will try and get um, a measurement. One of these, one of these videos, I will surprise you, and um, I will have um, the measurement for the blanket. To be, <laughs> uh, to be honest, I'll be, I'll surprise myself if I can remember that. <laughs> mm. I'm telling you. My mind is like taking a trip through Willy Wonka's Chocolate Factory. Where they're on the riverboat and they're going and everything's going really fast. I, I swear it's like um, you're in a boat in <laughs> Russ's mind. <laughs> you are gone. Oh my goodness. And, um, episode 51 of the Pickle Jar Minis, my blanket, this is number 52, but number 50 one wasn't a 40 minute video i was quite shocked but then again it's like no that's normal because i always stop and talk <laughs> my hands be going like this oh my goodness Well, I tell you, I'd rather be funny than drug out, um, tired. I am so enjoying these videos. Um, pre-recording them, and I'm not stressing. If one gets posted, it gets posted. If two get posted, well, you guys got a bonus. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, it, to me, it's funny. Mm. Some people wouldn't be able to, um, they'd go crazy um, if they had to keep up with me. Because some people are just um, that um, organized and they have to have everything just so. And there's nothing wrong with that. Don't get me wrong. But that's not for me. So. You get you get stuck with the crazy you get stuck with crazy Russ. That's probably what I should have called my channel, Crazy Russ. <laughs> that would have been a good channel name. I am liking this um, color. It's blues and purples, and it's a really nice color.
come nice and quiet. I always um, call my mom on, on my way going to work, and I didn't have to work tonight, Thursday night. I didn't have to work Thursday night. So I called her just because I wanted to update her on some things that was going on, and uh, she's like, you have to work tonight? It's like, no. I said, I just wanted to call and um, talk with you and um, update you. Because if I didn't, I would have forgot. Come Sunday night, yeah, Russ would have forgot. I could not believe when I went to um, Amazon and looked for those um, these crochet hooks that I'm using and saw that they were $23.73, I think. It's like, wow, they went up. Because at Christmas time, I know I bought my niece a set and they were only $12 and something. I should video chat with her this weekend. See how her and everyone's doing. Well, I am into the second color. Well, I brought everything from the dining room to the living room so I could uh, make this video because Kevin's sleeping. It's 4 o'clock in the morning, but Kevin's upstairs sleeping. He'll be getting up here in a little bit, but um, I brought everything in to do this wonderful video. And guess what Russ forgot? Besides his, <laughs> besides his mind, um, I think I left that two streets over. I forgot to grab my jar of yarn to pull out the next two colors. I sure did. So, when we are done, I will have to go get my jar. And, uh... Come back with it so we can pick out the next two colors. I mean, I could just wait and pick them up at the beginning of the next video. I don't want to do that. I'm just loving this blanket. And I just remembered, 
I do have to buy some yarn. And that won't be cheap because it comes from Miss Babs. And I think they only have a sale like once a year, and that's at Christmas, on Christmas Day, at midnight. So on the 24th, when it hits midnight to turn to the 25th, that's when Miss Babs has their sale. But I can't wait that long. Because I want to get this um, other knitting project started. But it might, that project's probably going to have to wait until I get this project done. Because I just don't... I mean, I could do them together. But one day you might get a knitting video. The next day you might get a crochet. Or you might get a tote of yarn day. And I got to have Kevin help me this weekend because I want I need him to hold the camera. I need yeah I need him to hold the camera while I show you guys how I um, ball up these little minis because people have asked me um, if I would show how I do it because I don't have any equipment or anything I just have it flat on the table. And I start winding it in a ball. But you got to be very, very careful when you do that. And in one of my videos, I was talking about, um, you know, hanking up your yarn and uh, washing it um, before you use it to soften it up. So... The best, the best way to dry that, you want, you want to wash it in a um, laundry bag anyhow, or a pillowcase. Uh, and you need, you really need to make sure that you have um, the hank of yarn really, really tied well around, because you do not want it to un start knotting up, because as it tumbles, spins, agitates. And you only want to do it with acrylic. So, um, the best way to dry that is air dry. Or laid over a rack or something. But if you have a shoe rack for your dryer, where you put it in and you put your shoes on it, and the dryer goes around, but your shoes stay flat. Now, if you have a dryer like that, then that would be okay to dry. But other than that, I would air dry. And do not wash in the washing machine wool yarn. Do not. I don't even wash my super wash wool in the washing machine. It's all hand done. I All my wool. So this blanket that I'm making, even though it's super wash merino, it will only be hand washed. I will wash it either in the shower or the bathtub. I'm looking forward to going to dinner tonight. Kevin's mom and dad, which I already said that. A lot of people hate when I repeat myself, and I apologize. I just, I'm thinking it, so I say it.
We're at 30 minutes. See what I'm talking about? When I sit down and start talking and crocheting, it's just like, where's the time? The time does not stand still. And I need to get me something to eat. I think I will have me a um, egg sandwich. I think I will. Either that or some fruit. One of the two. Maybe fruit. I love grapefruit. The kind that's already peeled, sectioned off. Yeah. Don't make me peel my grapefruit. It's not pretty. Pretty funny, but not pretty. A pretty sight. <clears throat> Aberdeen uh, Wool posted a video on YouTube. Um, their um, poet um, yarns. I'll see if I can get the link. And if I can get the link, I'll put it in the box. They don't post too often, um, but they also have a Facebook group or a Facebook page. Um, so, but they had, um, she had posted um, a picture of, uh, because they raised the sheep and that's what they get the wool from. I'm sure they um, have to buy. I'm get. I don't know because I am not affiliated with the company at all. I just like their um, yarn, and I support them. They deserve. They need um, support. Or it's like any small business. Without support, you have no business. So, but she had posted some pictures of um, the sheep. Um, last year when um, the sheep was, one of the sheep was born, um, she actually sent me um, a picture of the sheep that was born. And I thought that was awful nice of her. You know, she's busy too, you know. She 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 don't have time to keep on answering crazy Ross. <laughs> mm. But mm. but that's just me. You know, I I send out messages. You know, like people are um my dearest friend and I don't know why I do that. And then it's like I take their um niceness as a token of I'm moving in only Russ we are going to round this corner we had enough yarn to round this corner Ah, 
how much more yarn? I don't know. Because my yarns, I have um, in front of my chair, I have a cart. It's metal with um, plastic drawers. And it's on wheels. It's a, it's a really nice cart. Um, the drawers are all full. Of course. But when I'm in here crocheting, um, the little small things, I just open up a drawer, pop it in there, and close the drawer, and it acts like a um, yarn bowl. I'm still trying to find my yarn bowl. I've got one. I just don't know where it's at. Might have to get another one. Hey, I rounded the corner. I don't think I got much yarn left, though. I don't think I do. This is going to be another 40-minute video. Hope you guys don't mind the extra 10 minutes. If you guys um, don't want me going past 30 minutes, just let me know. And I'll start stopping it at 30. <clears throat> this is like the never ending story. This yarn never ends. But that's in a good way. That's not in a bad way. Oh, there it is. There's still a little, there's still quite a bit of yarn to left. I'm shocked. Oh, we're just going to keep on going until we use it up. And we are in the home stretch. That's all we got. I mean, there's still, there's still quite a bit there, don't get me wrong. There's enough there to do four or five grannies. Granny clusters. How about a few more granny clusters? <laughs> mm. These little minis go um, a long way. And we are at the end. There it is. There it is. Okay, guys. I'm going to have to um, put you on pause for a minute while I go grab my jar. Okay, here we go. We got our jar. Let's see what we can pull out. <clears throat> Ooh, a nice red. And we got a fuchsia. Okay. So those are our two colors. It is what it is. My magic jar. The magic jar has spoken. 
The jar of many colors has spoken. I should knit. I should knit a cozy and put over this jar. I should. That just gave me an idea. We'll see. We'll see. So, anyhow. Thank you guys. I love you. You know I do. I don't think I said that in my last video. I, I think it's the only one where I didn't say I love you. And I feel so bad. But anyhow. <clears throat> I love you. Don't forget it. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.